dun 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 I'm sure you're asking me, well, hello everyone. <laughs> I'm sure you're asking me, Jake, if I'm not mistaken, Chasing, if I'm not mistaken, this is the Batman Animated Series Blu-ray. How can you recommend that to be the movie of the day? Well, it's very simple. In this collection, Batman the Animated Series Blu-ray, because mind you, I also don't have all my movies at my disposal right now, uh, is The Mask of the Phantasm. As a Batman fan, as a diehard Batman fan, as a diehard film fan, I get the question all the time, what's the best Batman movie of all time? Is it The Dark Knight? Is it Batman Begins? Is it Batman Forever? Is it the 1980 classic Batman? 1985 classic Batman? No. It's The Mask of the Phantasm, an animated movie that came out in the 90s. And if you don't believe me, and if you think, hey, this guy, is this a nerd? He has no idea what he's talking about. Go back and watch Siskel and Ebert. Go YouTube. If you don't know who Siskel and Ebert are, most famous critics probably in the country because they had a TV show and they kind of really made film criticism mainstream. You know, they would rate three or four movies a week, giving it thumbs up, thumbs down. And they very rarely talked about animated pictures. But they talked about Mask of the Phantasm and they go on and on about how truly a monumental picture in animation it is. You could talk about Pixar and Disney all day, but the grittiness, the darkness, the use of shadows, all of the look of Mask of the Phantasm makes it a masterful animation film. But the story, the characters, that makes it the best Batman movie. Um, seeing Bruce Wayne look at his parents' graves, seeing a sh flash of lightning, and then the cow, I mean, all of this beautiful, beautiful imagery that is so symbolic for the bat. And if you guys know me, you know I love the bat. Um, it is just so powerful, so meaningful. Bruce finally gets a chance at happiness, and of course he lets his guard down, only to be... Uh, I, I don't even want to tell you if you've never seen this movie, but go, go, you, go to YouTube. Siskel Ebert, Mask of the Phantasm, and watch how they talked about going into movie theaters with kids, the parents bringing their kids to see this, because let me tell you, this ain't a kid's movie either. Parents would bring their kids to this movie, and kids left crying because of how dark and real it was, how sinister the Joker was. So, so good. Batman Mask of the Phantasm, the best Batman movie. You could bet your life on it. And if you want to talk about it, there's the comment section because I'm here all day. Don't get me wrong. I love the Nolan Batmans. I love every Batman being a Batman fan, but nothing equates to the Bat, the Dark Knight himself, the Cape Crusader. Then my pick of the day, Batman Mask of the Phantasm. See you guys soon.